Happy 4th of July, y'all. Happy 4th of July. The rain finally stopped. It's been raining all day. Finally stopped. It's like, what time is it? I'm not even sure. 7 o'clock? Yeah, at night. So Kim's going to try to start a fire, even though the rain's been raining on our firewood all day. Yep. And we're going to try to cook some ribs on our new little electric grill over there. And just enjoy the rest of the night while there's no rain. Aaron's making ribs for the first time. Woo! We'll see how it goes. I hope they're edible. I don't know. Never made them. So anyway, yeah. We've had a couple fireworks already, so Zach's got his thunder jacket on over there. So yeah. Thanks for joining us, y'all. We are Kim and Aaron, and this is Zach and Cody. We are best friends living and traveling full time in our renovated RV, Lucy. We have been on the road since October 2020, so please subscribe to join in on all the fun. RVTV, K and E RVTV, sing it with us. We got a chipmunk in our sight. He's right on the log. Oh, he just went behind the flamingo. Where'd he go? Oh, there he's on the other rock. Oh, he now he's crossing the street. Oh, he ran across the street. Bye, chipmunk. <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Happy This is Aaron. Hello. I'm the E and the K and E R B T V, y'all. <laughs> you been having a good time today, ma'am? Yeah, a lot of food prepping. Food prepping, Inside, yeah. Inside, hiding from the rain. Yes. It's been I'm bad, but it finally stopped. And then tomorrow is supposed to be beautiful. So I'm hoping we can get out and explore tomorrow. We're looking forward to that. But yeah, I'm making some ribs. Ribs. So, are you gonna tell people what you did with the ribs? Yes. So, first thing I did was we just got um, it was a little over a pound of ribs, I believe. Yeah. Like a pound and a quarter, something like that. A pound and a half, maybe. So, I cut them into about three rib bones each, and then boiled them in some sugar-free juice. So, I ended up boiling the ribs in some sugar-free juice. This is what we used. Jill sugar. Like mango passion it is so good and it's zero sugar yeah and it has some mangoes some apples lemon plum flavor so we thought that could be fun with pork and i also i also added some beef broth mm -hmm. and water so kind of did maybe like equal parts of each probably a little more juice than anything because i did use a lot of the container not the whole thing we saved about a water bottle's worth just to have the juice because we enjoy mm -hmm. it but i did that for about a half an hour i did throw two cloves in there just to kind of you boiled it. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't mention that. I don't think you did. <laughs> so we boiled it. She <laughs> boiled it with all of that. <laughs> magical potion and put the ribs in that. So we did that, let them rest until they were cool enough to touch. Then I rubbed them with just some regular yellow mustard. And then I coated them and rubbed that in with butt rub seasoning. But you can use your seasoning of choice. We just love butt rub and there's no added sugar. So and it's tasty. Your hair is phenomenal, by the way. Oh, thank you. <laughs> this is what <laughs> prepping food all day is. Like, I also made some deviled eggs earlier, just so we can have that. Because they are, you know, low sugar, low carb, and tasty. Appetizer. Fourth of July, and we did get some sliced watermelon, just because it is Fourth of July. Some natural sugar is not going to hurt us. Good hydration, so we're going to have that for dessert. Yeah. Oh, that's dessert. Well, yeah. So okay. What else did you get? Yeah. We got sugar-free right? candy. True, but I'm talking for like 4th of July. Oh, gotcha. Watermelon screams 4th of July. Yeah. Happy birthday, America. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> what you got, Mrs. Doubtfire? <laughs> I got our ribs that we boiled in our little witch potion that rubbed down with mustard and then rubbed down with butt rub. And now we're going to place them on I the I don't oil. like mustard. You're not going to taste it. It cooks off. It cooks so, off. Okay. We're starting off at 300. So I let the got the grill on high. Let it hit 300. This is our new grill if you didn't watch our last video. Yeah. And then we're going to go ahead and place them on here. And now we will put them on the grill. Mm -hmm. I forgot <coughs> the tongs in the earlier clip. Excuse you. We're trying to film over here. Uh, can I help you? He's like, I smell ribs. Yeah. <laughs> They're not cooked yet, Cody. We gotta cook them. Hush <laughs> them out. <laughs> he wants okay. to go play with all the other dogs that are walking by. Here we go. Take Cody. three. Close your mouth, Cody. Okay. So again, we got the grill for 300. We're gonna take the ribs. We're gonna put them, the little membrane bone side down. I don't know what the, what's this dog wants. I don't know. He probably just <laughs> wants to be involved. He's like, show me attention. Yeah. He was never a barker in his whole life. No. Until probably the last like few months. How is he? Yeah. And so he, just... he has no problem telling us what he wants now. Yeah. 
What, what do you, you want? want? You just went for a walk. I think there's been a lot of people walking by. Uh -huh. And stuff, so he wants to like go be. He's so yeah, social. He's social. He's so rude. <laughs> he's just saying hello. He's just saying hello, everybody. Hello, YouTube land. <laughs> he's saying happy 4th of July, everyone. <laughs> These look amazing. <laughs> Deviled eggs, baby. Deviled eggs. It's not 4th of July without doubled eggs, right? Right. I'm ready. The air makes good ones. Oh, they're sloppy. All right. Do Cheers. You, do you bite Do you bite it in half or you just put the whole thing in your I mouth? I bite it, otherwise, Will yeah. Want to make a mess? Do you want to bite mm -hmm. it? Mm -hmm. Be classy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I mean, Aaron doesn't put too much mustard. <laughs> I would put way more. <laughs> Getting my fire going here. It's been uh, taking a minute, but it's going. It's going. Everybody here is having a good time. What are you doing? <laughs> How's your deviled eggs? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are, you, are you sharing? Are you sharing with our uh, gnome here? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You said they're good? Cody? Cody, did you get an egg? Not yet. No, he did not. No, he did not. He wants one, though. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't know if you can see, but there's a boat going down, a pontoon boat going down the lake down there. I wish we were on a boat. People at both ends of the beach, there's this bigger beach, there's also a smaller beach on the other side. We've just seen everybody in their bathing suits yeah. now that it's not raining. They're out, they're playing, you can hear the music, fishing. Well, the, hopefully the next few days are going to be nice, so maybe yeah. we'll be able to do some stuff. Yes, we are off tomorrow. So yeah. like, have And we were lucky enough when we had 4th of July off. True. It just happened to fall on our days off. Yeah. We very, got lucky. Very lucky, but <laughs> we would have been even more lucky if it didn't rain. Yes. But now we're trying to make the best of it, so it was hard too because we were like hunkered down all day, which makes you lazy. We went you shopping. We had to go buy all the food. Yeah. So yeah. that got us out of the house, and then we were like, all right, waiting for the rain, waiting for the rain, and they cleared up. And it's nice now. It's not super hot. Which yeah. Is great. Yeah, or humid. Yeah. All right, so it's been about 15 minutes, so I kind of want to check it again. I'm not super familiar with this grill, so I want to kind of. I'm gonna see what our bottoms are looking like. All right, so the ends are kind of crisping up, so I think it might be time to turn her down. Mm, no, that's yummy. And start the basting process, right? Do you agree? You're the rib eater. Yeah, Ooh. I guess so. Yeah, let's trade these off because this one's already getting. Oh, I'm excited. All right, so we're gonna drop. She's at a five, which is the highest that she goes. So I'm gonna go down to maybe like. In between three and four, kind of see what that's gonna do. And I have my barbecue sauce, and I'll show you what we're gonna use. Cause again, we're trying to keep this low sugar. Thank you, memory card, for being full. It's so, it cut air enough. <laughs> again, we're using sugar-free barbecue sauce to base our ribs. Love this. Sweet brand. and spicy. It's really, really good. Yeah, this brand, all the flavors are really great. But this is our favorite. Alrighty. So now that I have it turned down, we're gonna go ahead and get a baste in. Baste them up, baby. Yeah. I'm excited. Never made me ribs before. I've never made ribs before. Well, Aaron's not the biggest meat on the bone kind of person. Yeah, I've only like recently, like I would say the last few years, started eating ribs because dad makes the best for your ribs. Mm -hmm. So, um, I couldn't help but eat them so that kind of opened the door for me plus Flanagan's if anybody knows South Florida mm -hmm. Flanagan's is a kind of like a seafood bar and grill and mm -hmm. they have the bestest ribs ever so good they're yeah, just, just like meat sticks right these here? up yeah I just pretend like the bone is like a little skewer it's harder for me I don't eat bone and chicken because I just can't get past like my brain just can't get past the fact that it used to walk around with a face <laughs> That's kind of the issue I have, and I also have a lot of texture issues. I guess that's, I don't know, just part of whatever. Who so, you are. Yeah, I didn't even really enjoy meat at all growing up, and like now it's like, I do enjoy steak. I do like a medium rare. <laughs> Go figure, but I don't know. I'm just weird. Let me know if any of you have weird food things, because <laughs> Kim makes fun of me all the time, because I have a lot of issues. <laughs> I do not. I would never, I would never do that. <laughs> 
Look how good my fire's going. Yes, I'm ready. <laughs> Whoa, you're like a dragon. <laughs> Don't drink that. <laughs> just laughing at ourselves for what we just did. <laughs> that was a total improv. Yeah, <laughs> improv. <clears throat> yeah, so we're trying to make the best of the rest of our night. Yeah, we wish we were around family and friends, but of course we have each other. That is one of probably like the downfall to yep. this lifestyle is mm -hmm. you're not around your family and friends very often throughout the mm -hmm. year. That part can be rough, but luckily we do have a lot of friends that visited us on the road, and we're hoping that some family is gonna hit us up and meet us up on our. We do our bestie well. Christina's coming next week. Yes, if you've been following along with our channel, you've seen Christina. She's a tall drink of water, and we she's like almost as long as our friendship yeah we've been friends with her actually came and her grew up in the same neighborhood on the mm -hmm. same street five houses down so yeah she's been around so she's definitely so we're definitely gonna do fun stuff when she's group. when she's coming yeah so fun stuff to come Dude, hopefully the weather will allow some outside vitamin d action mm -hmm. So she just flipped them and now they're getting some barbecue sauce on the other yeah, side yeah massage the, the belly too of right? course that's like Cody's favorite thing. The, oh, Cody belly rubs? loves uh, belly rubs. Zach's like, eh. he loves a booty scratch. <laughs> Cody loves a belly rub, and Zach loves a booty scratch. See, so check on Smacks. You think he's doing? I'll check on him. Luckily, there haven't been too many fireworks yet. Not yet. Yeah. Still not dark though, but there have been some. There were some earlier today, even at uh -huh. like two o'clock. So I don't get it when they do it during the day. Yeah, you can't even appreciate them. It's like you're wasting your money. But you know, teach it your own. Happy birthday, Mirko. Mirko. We got a Zachary in the window. <laughs> scared. He's so scared, and they haven't even gotten bad yet. Cause see those ears. <laughs> oh, hey, baby. Poor guy. We gave him some calming treats. He's got his thunder jacket on, so that's really all we can do for him at this point. The fire's still going, Kim. It's so pretty. So happy it's not pretty. Didn't get much of any kind of sunset with all the clouds, but it's definitely beautiful right now. We'll take it. So the side that I chose for our 4th of July dinner is asparagus. Just been marinating in some Italian dressing for a while. And now... We're gonna grill it. The ribs up to our little warming rack up there. Mm. And now we're gonna throw this there again. Oh, yes. Right on there. And you should smile. This could be a thumbnail. <laughs> Say, Happy Fourth of July. <laughs> oh, that scared me. <laughs> oh, poor Zachary. Oh. We this feel for so all the pups out there. Oops, I lost some in the grate. Oh, you can't turn them that way. <laughs> You're going to be <laughs> playing games. <laughs> Happy 4th of July, everyone. Woo! Those look delicious. Heated them through pretty well. And now we're going to get ready to plate because I am hungry. Are you hungry? I think it's going to take you 20 minutes to get these out of here. <laughs> Probably. Stay tuned. So leave a comment which y'all are having as your 4th of July feast. Feast. What are you guys having? Hope Probably. Probably some really, really yummy stuff. Potato chips. Potato chips? That's what you're thinking about? Potato I miss chips? Potato chips. <laughs> you don't want a nice juicy cheeseburger on a bun? Yeah. Uh, For sure. A hot dog. The deviled eggs were yummy though. Here's our beautifully finished plate of ribs and it asparagus. Smells, it smells so good. <laughs> mm hmm. Alright, let's try the asparagus first. It looks really good. Would you marinate it in Italian dressing? Mm-hmm. Okay. Good? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Next, the really ribs. nice, sweet and savory. Sweet and savory? Mm-hmm. All right, next to the ribs, girl. How's that rib, girl? Oh, everyone's having fun here. What you think of your ribs for the first time? Your face says it's delicious. <laughs> it's spicy. This barbecue sauce has a kick. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's mm -hmm. sweet and spicy. Mm -hmm. 
They do have different flavors. They just have they have a honey flavor mm -hmm. and like hickory, mm -hmm. I think, and original. Mm -hmm. So, but we like the sweet and spicy. Gives it a little good kick. Oh my God. You like the ribs? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sweet. So we just realized that Erin can't film me because now her hands are full of barbecue sauce. <laughs> so I set the camera up to film myself, but looks so good, Erin. Mmm. Mmm. So good. And that barbecue sauce definitely does have a kick to mm -hmm. it. Really, really good. Yummy. I think it was a good idea boiling, mm -hmm. boiling it in that juice. Definitely has a good, good flavor throughout. Really good. All right. We'll be back in a little bit after mm -hmm. we finish because not my hands are good. Yeah, we're gonna have to wash your hands <laughs> in it. So it'll probably be darker next time you see us. <laughs> We're gonna end the night with some watermelon. Ooh, there's a, the there's a car behind you. This is like, you're so bright. <laughs> there you are. <laughs> mm -hmm. Is it good? Oh, another car coming. A lot of people are coming home for the evening. Mm. Delicious. Oh, my turn. <laughs> <laughs> It's really good. Mm -hmm. Good watermelon in a minute. So good. It definitely tastes like the 4th of July, baby. Juicy. And summer. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Cheers, my friend. Happy 4th of July. Woo! I'm glad we can see the fireworks from here. Yay! Puppies. I love <laughs> But when you've seen fireworks at Disney, you can't get any better than that, right? I can't imagine their display for 4th of July. Okay, that's enough fireworks. Y'all know what they look like. Okay, I came back. We found a perfect spot, like right in between these trees with no obstruction. And we have both the dogs with us. I don't know. He didn't want to stay inside. He didn't want to stay. He didn't want us to leave him. Yeah. So he's here. They're here. He's not having the best time. But uh, he'd be doing this inside. Anyway. He'd be doing this inside anyway. So we'll be back inside soon. <laughs> All right, y'all. The fire's pretty much done. I'm just keeping it alive here with a styrofoam plate. <laughs> going well it was a good fire Erin threw her watermelon in the fire for some reason i didn't really do anything so i took it out <laughs> <laughs> but we enjoyed our fourth of july evening mm -hmm. we really enjoyed ourselves this weekend mm -hmm. we had such a good time in our last one vlog we had such a great day mm -hmm. but we appreciate y'all hanging out with us tonight the ribs came out great delicious Aaron. i'm definitely gonna make them again Mm -hmm. Always a little trial and error the first time we make something, but mm -hmm. I mean, I think our choice to boil them in that sugar-free juice in the beginning really gave the meat some really, mm -hmm. really nice flavor. For sure. Love it's just barbecue that sauce barbecue sauce is <laughs> so spicy. My lips were on fire. Yeah, so maybe the next time I'll use, um, they have that same brand, they have a honey barbecue, so they use that one. Mm -hmm. Get a little more sweet, less spicy. Yeah. Asparagus was delicious. We got to see some fireworks to end the night. Yeah, that was so great that we actually got to see them tonight. Yeah. It's been great. Yeah, um, yeah. I love our campground. Yeah, it's so lively. I don't know what to say. In Tennessee, our campground was uh, like I feel like there's much more activity here. That was an RV park. Yes. Not a campground. This is like a, a true campground. Uh huh. The difference. There's like people tent camping down there. There's pop-up tents. You know, there's small RVs, big RVs. They have Everybody does this they have life on the Weekends, a little bit during the week for the kids, arts and crafts. A lot going on here because it's aimed. It's campground for uh -huh. families to come enjoy yeah so we really you know we're very lucky here we've had a wonderful night we appreciate mm -hmm. all you tuning in and joining us mm -hmm. like we said earlier in the video tomorrow we are off and the weather is supposed to be well it's supposed to be really really good tomorrow so hopefully the video after this will be a fun one yeah we're gonna get out on an adventure and hopefully the rain stays away but we've heard there's more coming so even though y'all say you've been liking the home vlogs so maybe we'll have more of these coming too. Yeah, we'll keep them coming. Again, leave comments, questions that you have. We've already gotten a few on our last video. Uh -huh. So we'll definitely do a Q&A um, soon, I'm sure. 
Mm -hmm. So stay tuned, but we appreciate you all. And if you appreciated this video, please hit your like button. If you are new to our channel or you have not subscribed, please subscribe. We would really appreciate it. And we will see you in the next episode. Happy 4th of July, y'all. Bye, y'all. Peace out. Happy 4th of July.